Summer is the beginning of fun and freedom for students, but for some of those who experience food insecurities, it can be a tough time. That's why local school districts are partnering with organizations like the Coastal Bend Food Bank to make sure students have access to food even after the final school bell rings. Our Alexis Green has a story. One of those initiatives began today with the grand opening of West Oso ISD's Grace's Pantry, which according to communities and school chairman Ann Matella, is a food pantry that will give students who are food insecure access to nutritious and quality foods over the summer months. So throughout the COVID, so many families who had never experienced loss of employment or food insecurity, unfortunately have experienced that. And our goal in communities and schools is for children to stay in school and graduate. Michael Rodriguez with the Coastal Bend Food Bank says this is hopefully the start to more food pantries in our area because access to nutritious meals is vital to student success in school. I had that West Oso opened their uh, food pantry this, as of today. Uh, that was a big exciting moment for us. Uh, but we're working on other schools. Hopefully Flower Bluff ISD is going to open up something soon. Um, we've got, we're working on Robstown ISD to open up a food pantry. According to Rodriguez, along with the food pantries, they also plan to partner with the YMCA and the Boys and Girls Club to offer food backpacks this summer. So the Boys and Girls Club will have three locations that will distribute or hand out uh, our backpacks uh on a friday to any students that go to the our 10 boys and girls club rodriguez says the ymca will be visiting local school districts to provide these backpacks at their summer school sessions to those in need the backpacks are, are for uh the weekend uh consumption you know friday through monday enough to get them through through the weekend for more information on food distributions you can visit the coastal bend food bank's website lexis green three news